welcome back everyone now in this video i will be explaining how to fix missing or deleted windows services from your windows 10 and windows 11 so while doing any kind of troubleshooting or restarting any kind of services you find that many of the services are missing due to which you are not able to do any kind of troubleshooting so i'm talking about the services like windows update windows security windows installer vgc or any other similar services and if you have the same problem then i will be sharing four powerful solutions that you can apply and i'm very sure by the end of this video your problem will be fixed now before proceeding let me show you if i bring up the services on my windows 11 and if i look for the windows update i don't find the windows update service over here so it's missing so now what do i have to do First, you have to click on your Windows search, type CMD, right click on command prompt, click run as admin, click on yes. Now here the first command that you will have to type, that will be DISM space forward slash online space forward slash cleanup dash image space forward slash restore health. Now this command you will be also getting in the description, so you can copy and paste. So once you are done, you have to hit the enter key. Now this command will be running and it will take some time. So you will have to wait until this command is completed. And once the command is completed, you will find this kind of page. Now you have to run another command that will be SFC space forward slash scan now. Again, hit the enter key. Now this will be also taking some time. So you will have to wait here. And once this command will be completed, we will have to restart the computer and check back if the problem has been fixed. So let's wait until this command is also completed. Okay, now this command is also completed. So now what we can do, we can close everything. Then go ahead and restart the computer. And let's see that whether this fixed the problem or not. All right, so the computer has been restarted now. So again, if I search for services and open it. So let's see whether we find Windows update or not. Okay, so I still don't find the Windows update. So now let's move with the next solution. And for that, you need any other computer like any other laptop or any other kind of PC. Or you can also take the help of virtual machine. So if you don't have any other kind of PC or laptop, a part of this one, then you can also create a virtual machine, install Windows 11 or Windows 10, whichever you are using. And you also need a USB or any kind of external hard drive storage drive. Okay, so now let me switch to another computer. So now here what you will have to do, you have to click on your Windows search. Type REGEDIT. Then from the suggestion, you have to click on registry editor. Click on yes. Now here from the left hand menu option, double click on HK local machine. Then you have to go to system, double click on it. Then you have to go to current control set, double click on it again. Then you will find the services, double click on it. And now here you have to look for the service that is missing on your problematic computer. So on my end, Windows update is missing. So I will have to look either for Windows update or some key by the name WASUV. Okay, so I have to come to the W section. So I will scroll down. Here it is W U A U S E R V. Now, once you get it, you will have to click on it. Then from the top menu option, click on file. Then click on export. Now you have to name this as REG. Then you have to click on save or you can choose the location wherever you want to save. So let's say if I want to save in our desktop so i will select the location then i will click on save and now you can close it and now on your desktop you will find this reg file that we just saved here we exported and now next what you have to do you have to move this registry file to a usb drive through which we can transfer into the problematic computer okay so my usb is already connected so i will drag this file and save into this external drive so once it's been saved, I will plug out my USB and connect to the computer where I have the problem. 
so now i'm on my computer where i have the problem and i've connected that usb and this file is over here so you will have to click on it then click on yes you will be getting this kind of message you have to click on yes again and it will say the key and values contained in frag have been successfully added to the registry so click on ok now you can close it and now this time if i again open services i still don't see it so what i can do i can simply make a restart again all right so the computer has been restarted again and if i again go and search for services and this time if i look for windows update So here it is now you can see that windows update is now showing up so this is the best and the easiest method that you can apply now this method looks a little bit complicated but it's really not because you only need to take the help of any other computer that you have or probably someone in your family or friend you will have to take the registry file from their computer then you will have to install on your computer now in case if you also don't want to go with this option then what next you can do you can go ahead and restore your computer to the date when you feel that the services was available and was working fine so for that what you can do click on your windows search type rstrui.exe hit the enter key and if you have created any restore point then you will have to click on next choose the date where the computer was working fine and then you can restore your computer so these are the three best solutions that you can apply guys and I'm very sure that this will be helping you to fix the problem and if yes do not forget to like and subscribe and I see you in the next video. Bye bye.